you sign this whole packet. Let's just do that. Okay, so I've picked every single document. We've got all one, two, three, four, five, six documents. I'm going to close. Now those documents are right here. And now I am on to the next step. Okay, so I'm going to click here. And in this situation, I would pick my buyer number one and my buyer number two to sign these. These are made up emails, by the way, or hopefully they're not real emails that go out to anybody. Uh, and then I'm going to pick myself as a signer as well, because there are documents in here that I need to sign with my clients. Okay, so I pick the parties. Now the cool thing is, is I can decide which order I want people to sign at the same time. And so the signing order is kind of cool over here. We can pick one, two, and three, or in this situation, I want to sign the documents first so that the client knows, hey, Trevor signed these. Now I'm a little bit more comfortable in signing these as well. So I'm gonna make myself the number one si signer. Um, and then I'm also going to change Jill and John to the number two signers. So after I'm done signing, after I completed my signing, then it will email both John and Jill at the same time and say, whoever wants to sign first, great. You guys decide, but it will be in both of their inboxes. Thank you.